For some of them, Lissa Chanks is all they've ever known. Now fierce fighting in the city has made daily life untenable. We're leaving everything behind, everything that we've known for 70 years. We're leaving it all behind and running away, to God knows where. While residents have the chance to flee violence in Lissa Chanks, over in its sister city, Severodonetsk, evacuations have been halted by heavy shelling. This is Moscow tries to take control of the whole city. The offensive in the Severodonetsk direction is successfully developing. Individual units of the armed forces of Ukraine are leaving the combat area due to the low morale and psychological state, lack of ammunition and lack of support. Kyiv has denied Moscow's version of events. It claims its forces are still holding off Russia's advance. Analysts argue this resistance won't last long, though. They say Russia will likely seize Severodonetsk in the coming weeks. In spite of this, Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky is determined to stay positive. After a visit to the southern front line in Mykolaiv and Odessa Saturday, he declared his forces will win this war. Our defenders are confident, and it's obvious that none of them doubt victory. We'll not relinquish this house to anyone, we'll retrieve everything, and the sea will be Ukrainian and safe. Both Mykolaiv and Odessa have been targeted by Russian forces as they push to control the whole of the Black Sea coast.